Check out this RV. Oh, it has a whole master suite. This shit's pretty damn big. It's got the countertop, stove. Oh, this one even got an oven. The other one didn't have a refrigerator. Stainless steel. And it's hot as hell in here. AC unit. Yep, right there. I don't know. Oh, damn, it even has a back door. A bathroom door. So you ain't even have to come through all the way through. I don't know. Let's see if I can let's see if I can fit in the shower. Let's see if it's fat man approved. Yep. That's fat man approved. It's kinda tight, but that's not the RV fault. 300 pound man. <laughs> I wonder if you could take these out though. I wonder if you could take these out. This bunk bed. I wouldn't need that. I don't know. I don't need space for something else. Storage. Well, I guess you could just use it as a shelf. <laughs> yeah. Storage or something. Oh, and it has a privacy curtain. Let's see. I don't think the table's wind down so you can lay, but it's kitchen and oh I didn't realize that it actually is a a gas fireplace. I guess you put the TV right there. Or on the countertop. No, yeah, put the TV right there on the mantle. It's just pretty damn big. Is this a slide out? That's why? Oh, that's why it's a slide out. It's a slide out, okay. I don't know why it felt a little too big. <laughs> so all this slide, all this would slide in. Then this whole area, this whole area would slide in. Then you can slide it out when you get where you're going. I don't know if it's mechanical. Or it's probably electrical. I'd rather have both. In case that shit, the motor burns out or some shit, I can still winch it in and out. I guess. But yeah, that's it.